In this video, I will explain how to download latest version of Smart PLS. First, you go to Google and type Smart PLS download. After that, you click on download Smart PLS latest release that is 4.1. When you click here, you will land on this page and you can download as per your operating system. I am using Microsoft Windows, so I click on download Windows installer. When I click here, it starts downloading. You can see here, it takes few minutes. When it is downloaded, you can click on exe file. It starts installing Smart PLS 4 on your system. It takes few minutes to install. Click on finish button to run Smart PLS 4. When you run Smart PLS first time, it gives you three options to register it. First is student lessons that is almost free for many years. Second one is professional lessons that is for those who have purchased a valid license key. Third one is free 30 days trial lessons. I suggest if you did not purchase the valid key, you go for free 30 days trial lessons. And after 30 days, you can convert your software on student version that is almost free for many years. So I click on free 30 days trial lessons. When I click on it, you will land on this page. Here you enter your email ID, first name, last name, and click on submit. You will receive a confirmation code in your mailbox. Please check your mailbox. Here I have received confirmation code that is C8295. I copy and I enter here and click on submit button. You can see here I got professional license for 30 days. After 30 days, you can convert your license into student version that is almost free. If you want to talk about the difference between student version and professional version. In student version, there is limitation in functionality. For example, you cannot analyze data if your sample size is greater than 100. However, in professional version, there is no limitation in functionality as far as data analysis is concerned. Now I click on start uses and uh, create my workspace by selecting any empty folder. Here I created an empty folder with the name of workspace. I select this folder. Now it's ready to use. You can analyze your data. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to my channel.